Vicky from WSS Equestrian. Welcome to my video on how to clip your horse's tail for the show ring. In today's video, I have my model Bonnie, my good friend Chloe's horse, who is about to go to her first show. So in today's video, she's gonna be our model about for trimming up her tail, getting it ready for presenting herself for the show ring. So in this video, I'll show you what we do to or what I do and how I clip my horse's tail without pulling. It's just the nice, friendly way of preparing a horse's tail for the show ring. So just scissors, all you need is scissors and clippers. That's it uh, for what I do. And a brush and a brush just to be able to see where all the hair goes. So without further ado, let's jump on into it and I'll show you how to do it. All right, so I've got my three tools, the clippers that are my cordless ones, my bamboo brush and the scissors to cut her tail. So firstly, give her a brush. Also, side note, it really helps that the horse is clean, like you scrub the tail so that you get all that dirt and mud and build up and dust and skin, get that out of the way so it's not a hard job for the clippers. Alright, so now that it's been brushed, we're going to trim with the scissors. So, I pick, just have a play with how far down you go. There, this is the dock and at least a good 10, 10 12 centimetres from the dock. You don't want to meet the dock with trimming down the sides, you want to, just a nice, area you want to keep you the aim of the game with trimming and trimming the dock is one you don't have to plait because that can be a bit tricky presentation wise if you can't plait correct like really tightly and make it a pitch perfect plaiting job so that's where and that's why people clip let's jump into this guys so get my scissors and i trim up the sides i'm going to pick it just starts shorter rather than longer because you you can play with it coming down further along the side of the dock when you're trimming but if you start by cutting the tongue off, yeah, you're gonna have to wait for all that hair to grow back. Pro tip for all the learners out there and the beginners, if you've never done this before, do not rush. Make sure you've got plenty of time up your sleeve and don't stress and don't panic. Don't worry about it if it's not perfect the first time. Practice makes perfect. I have been doing this for the last seven years now, so I am well adjusted and I've got the eye for, you know, how to treat the hairs and how to cut and, and whatnot with working with the hairs, the scissors and the clippers. And this is just my technique where I go down the side of the dock and I cut away the hairs with the scissors first and then we will hit them with the clippers. So it does take a little bit of time to slowly chip away. Don't take large chunks of hairs off straight away. Take it slow and steady with little bits of hair here and there um, in your cuts with the, with the scissors because you don't want to destroy the horse's tail presentation wise and make it a really bad hair job. So definitely slow and steady, have enough time up your sleeve and take little bits at a time. The only way you'll get better at this is practicing. So in the off season, practice like mad. Practice as often as you can. You know, you'll get into the groove, you'll get into your own style and you will work out what looks best on your horse and what works for him or her and whatnot. So practice makes perfect. That's the biggest hint I can give you today in this video is practice, practice, practice. Alright guys, there we have it. Her tail is done. It is, that is the scissors section. So it's already taking a really nice shape. We, the aim of the game is a nice slim dock with the nice short hair. That's why it's cut so short and shaved on the side. The aim of the game with this is you either pull the hairs in by plaiting it to make it really thin looking dock or you shave. And they're the two options when it comes to presenting your horse's dock for the show ring. And the reason why we wanna make this nice and slim and small, you wanna help emphasize and make those hindquarters look much bigger than what they are because it's all, the aim of the game of showing is uh, misdirection and all that jazz if your horse has faults in confirmation and all that jazz. So that's a big part. Uh, and then 
not all, not every horse has faults in confirmation that, but that's a big part in helping misdirect um, those small minor faults if the horses do have them. But if you don't, it doesn't matter, you still do this anyway, because it's a big part of looking neat and tidy. That's the main part of it, but most of the little niggles are a little bit of misdirection for those horses with faults. So, all right, now I'm gonna grab my clippers. It's clipper time, we're gonna shave along this to make it really nice and short. All right, let's get doing. If you've never brought clippers anywhere near your horse before, introduce them very carefully. Be very careful at home. Always have a helper with you just in case something happens, you get hurt, horse get hurt. Anything is possible with horses, so you operate this at your own risk. And these horses, they're well adjusted to it. This horse that I'm clipping right now, she is a standard bred, so she's had, you know, she's seen a lot in her life being an ex-pacer. So they've seen a lot. I've worked mainly with thoroughbreds and they've gone and seen a lot of the world and they have so much experience and they're pretty well-tempered animals. So I've not had one horse that hasn't let me trim their tail dock. Uh, these horses have been very forgiving and very workable with. So and Bonnie's done an amazing job today standing there letting me trim her tail with the scissors and the clippers. And she looks a million dollars and I'm so happy with how she's turned out. There we have it. It is done. It just looks really lovely. This is the first time Bonnie's had her tail done up clipping wise for the show ring. So this looks so smart and beautiful compared to what it did beforehand. Let's back that up. Yeah, so there we have it guys. So when you come down here, don't make it a blunt cut here. You want to dip it down. So make it a nice sort of like half a circle here. You don't want, don't make it a cut, blunt cut there. You want it to arch over when you come down to end it. So what that be? 10, 20, almost 20, almost 20 um, centimeters long down the side of her dock, but that's for this horse. She's a little smaller horse, bigger horses, obviously you've got to cut a little bit longer. So definitely start off by trimming much shorter compared to trimming like straight away i'm going to start down here like her docks here don't start just a bit above the dock definitely start at the top and work your way down just a little bit and yeah now she's all ready to go for her first horse show so do this definitely two weeks before the first show and then every so many days just trim this with clippers or if you get razors like men's chuck away razors get them have them in your fat max or your grooming box to be able to shave here to make sure that this is nice and smooth and short and not prickly and growing back with hair so here we have it guys that's how i trim a horse's tail for the show ring <laughs> she's in a really good mood for a lady at the moment so yeah that's it guys hope you like the video please give us a big thumbs up leave a comment down below i uh, hope you enjoyed and if you you learned something took something away good luck with all your show horse presentation we'll see you in the next video bye